Hi everyone, I'm Catherine and this is Gracie Designs. So today I'm going to show you how to create a mood blanket. It's made out of granny squares and it's very easy to make because you're going to make only one square per day. This reason being that it's a mood blanket, so you want to make one square for how you're feeling that day, what your mood is. You pick five, six, maybe seven colors of yarn and you have each color represent a mood. So when I made my blanket, I tried to keep the squares in order because I wanted the mood to follow the calendar. Uh, the reason I'm, I'm starting this blanket before summer starts is because um, by the time fall comes, if you do one square a day, you'll have a pretty nice size throw blanket. If you want to keep going and work through the winter, you can even make a larger blanket. Aside from doing your mood of the day square, which you can also make as small or as big as you like, you're also going to need a second color to go around that. So this way you have a base for when you join them together. Very colorful. You can also make um, use colors of maybe nature colors like all browns and yellows and beiges or um, colors of the rainbow or even um, just random colors or um, whatever colors you know you would like to use to make um, your mood blanket. Pick the yarn color and then pick the mood to go with that color. I also wrote in a journal each day along with crocheting my granny squares. You'll be working on this blanket for a few months until you feel you have enough squares to make the size blanket you desire. As far as how large to make each granny square, that's entirely up to you. In this picture, the mood color is only three rounds and then the white border is only one more row and the brown border is two more rows. Five to six rows for a complete granny square is recommended. So as far as the granny square, I have three videos on how to create a granny square. I have how to make, um, how to crochet a granny square. I have how to change colors for a granny square. And I have a video on how to um, put the granny squares together. Go to my crochet playlist to see all three videos. And stay tuned, I'm going to show you the, my finished blanket. So here is my crocheted mood blanket. Um, I Mine is 16 by 12 squares, so it's pretty large. I, I have to make a blanket this big. You can make a little throw. Uh, this actually covers a double bed. And um, I also, on my squares, I made the mood color large, and then I only did one row of the finishing color. So why not get started today with your first square and make um, yourself a very colorful mood blanket. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to subscribe, like, comment, and share my channel. And uh, join me next time on Gracie Designs. Thank you.